Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Aftermath. I'm your host, Iggy Koopa, and I'm the other host, Dr. Ivo Robotnik. On this show, we interview past Lemonade contestants, ask them questions, and something that could have happened if they impacted the competition. And right here, we have our peanut gap. Uh, Robotnik, what is this? Uh, just cut to the intro, cut to the intro. Uh, well, why? Cut to the intro! Hey, what's up? I'm here to slay. Don't know why the rest even bother to stay. I know the game and I'm proud to skill. Crushing players' dreams, yeah, you know the drill. I Welcome back to the Aftermath, and uh, right now we are just talking about on who are these people. Seriously? You don't know me, dude? I'm literally from the same game as you. Oh, um, honestly, I, I really don't know you that much, because I'm pretty sure my dad knows you. Uh, I guess that makes sense. But seriously, Robotnik, what are these people doing here? I, th I just wanted to get, like, you know, sent you out to go get the other ones who didn't compete or were, like, eliminated in the season. Oh, well, uh, uh, they're gonna be, like, the, the newbies for season six. And why reveal that now? Well, I mean, like, I'm pretty sure they're not all gonna be newbies for season six. Remember, Chocolate Bar is gonna be coming soon. Oh, that's true. But with the time that we have right now, let's just get to our first guest. Anyways, so our first contestant, or, you know, first guest here, is, uh, someone who's, like, a fireball. And, uh, someone that's, like, that's an object. That's, like, this really big phone thing right here he also won season two of his respective season so everybody welcome in winner of bfdi and of season two fiery <laughs> hey everybody so glad to be here okay now fiery we're just gonna give you a few questions and then we will send you on your way because i think you don't want to be around these weirdos so, let's start with the basic one, Fiery. How did you feel after you got eliminated in the Yellow Submarine episode? To be honest, I was a bit shocked, but then when I kind of think about it, I I'm pretty believe pretty much believe that I didn't really do much to begin with, and I'm pretty sure this is more of a downgrade than I was like in back in season 2, so yeah, yeah, you know, just throwing it out there. Yeah. Huh, that's a uh, pretty interesting, I must say. Alright, so Fiery, I have another question for you. And this might be another simple one. Are you and Leafy still dating? Well, I mean, like, yeah, obviously. I mean, like, why wouldn't we? Can you actually give me a question that actually requires thinking, please? Hm. you want to do it like that? Then here's your question. Who do you think is the worst person on Total Fluffy Season 4? Ooh, that's actually a hard one. Hmm. Uh, I'll say... Ludwig? Well, uh, to be sure that we know that that's, you know, that's a lie or not a lie, then we have our special friend. Special friend? Whoa. <laughs> oh. oh, what the? What is that? Well, basically that thing dropped because, uh, well, you don't, uh, the most person, you do, you, you know, um, are you stuttering or um, what? Alright, so you basically lied that you actually kind of like Ludwig a bit, and you don't hate him the most out of everybody. So who is it? Okay then, um... It's a... Okay, it's Coiny, alright? Wow, wait a minute, why Coiny? He barely even did anything. I don't know, I still found him a bit annoying at times. Wow, talk about a friend. Well, hey, look, we were mostly enemies to begin with, alright? Eh, whatever. But anyway, since we do have an important announcement by the end, we're going to have to ask you to leave now. <sighs> Thank you. I'm out. Bye-bye. Anyways, now time for our next guest. Yes, and he's basically one that's really well known in this Total Fluffy franchise. He's blue, and he's fast. And I know any word that rhymes with cast. He is the first ever winner of Total Fluffy. Everyone... Sonic. Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? So, Sonic, we want to ask you some questions as well. So, how did you feel on how, uh, you know, leaving in Yellow Submarine along with Fiery and, and, you know, others? Well, to be honest, I thought it was, like, completely unfair. Because, well, we were supposed to do, like, like what the basis of the challenge was supposed to be. Like, catch that killer dude. 
But uh, yeah, I did that thing. And then what did, what did my team do? They voted me off. At least Bowser was someone that could, you know, sympathize with me. I mean, like, we were literally the ones that did it. And besides, we had to eliminate, like, three people or something. So, um, in contrast, I don't know why they didn't even vote Bowser either. Probably because you're a Noah. How am I a Noah? Well, I, I don't know. They just, it's just stereotypes. Like, total drama stereotypes? Technically. You know what? I'm done with this. But what, Sonic? We didn't even do most of the questions. I don't care. Oh. You know what? Forget about it, uh... Well, just getting with our next guest. I didn't even get to ask any questions. Shut up. Anyways, here we have a big frog whose current voice actor is Matt Vogel, and he kind of sucks. He was once on The Masked Singer playing a little snail. Hey, everybody, welcome here. Come at the frog. Oh. Uh, hey, everybody. Uh, how's it going? Hey, Kermit. It's nice to see that you can make it. Oh, well, anything, dude. All right, now we have some questions. How did you feel when you left the show? Well, to be honest, I felt a bit sad, because that means I had to be away from Bowie. And that makes me sad. Oh, well, how sad? Very sad. Well, okay then. Uh, Did you have any feelings for anyone else before you started to date Bowie? Hmm. Well, honestly, probably no one else. And, uh, you know, I don't remember anyone else that actually had a liking for me other besides her. And besides, mostly I would just stick to my own mind, so, uh, you know, I guess it goes that, I guess. Mm. Huh. Well, uh, unfortunately, Kermit, we don't have any more questions to ask you, because unfortunately, you're not an interesting character this season. Oh, poo. Alright, well, anyways, step over here, and then, uh, you know, you can be on your way. We. Huh, he can fly. Anywho, we have our final guest for the night. Wait, final guest? Uh, yeah, we literally could, we only could afford these ones to appear in this episode. Oh. Well, anyways, so, she is part of this so-called evil alliance made by some sort of anonymous contestant. Her character design is based off of Teen Titans Go, one of the worst cartoons ever. Everyone meet Raven. Uh, seriously? Why did I have to come here? Couldn't it have been Eevee? Well, we would, but if you weren't part of the Evil Alliance, then we would have just let you off the hook. But now we have some questions for you. First of all, did you expect to be eliminated at all in your elimination episode? Well, to be honest, I really thought that they would be smarter than that to not eliminate me. Well, technically you are smart, so I guess they were smart enough to get you eliminated. Ha. Ow! Now, uh, since we got all that out of the way, oh, well, like, uh, do you know anything on who could be this uh, quote-unquote leader of this evil alliance? Well, to be honest, um, I actually still don't know. Neither does the other ones. And I don't want to say them out loud because I don't know if others are also watching this. Well, you know, doing it so they know about the evil alliance, but... But, uh, but for right now, I don't know, and the others don't even know. And now I am bored. Well, that's great, because that's all we came here to ask you for. Seriously? This is supposed to be like an aftermath, and you're just doing this for, like, short times? Yes, what's so wrong with that? Uh, okay, well, anyways, the door's right there, then. Let me try to get my vest back on. Whatever, this show sucked anyways. And so, everybody... That was our four guests for the aftermath, but this episode isn't even done yet. Oh yeah, and also you see these ones right here? Well, these are the ones that can be possible contenders for season 6, Fans vs. Favorites. Yes, and speaking of Fans vs. Favorites, we're on the Ensemble! Oh. Well, uh, technically we're part of a 30-person vote. Huh, 30-person? Yep, me? and Robotnik are part of the 30 people who are handpicked by the creator of this channel on to have another chance at competing for the million. And also, this is only going to be for the ones that aren't in the current Season 4 running or Season 5 running. So, uh, yeah, just think about that. Ooh, this has to be interesting. Yeah, and also we got to finally say something. 
well, uh, you know what, I don't care about you guys, and, uh, and actually try to figure out your voices, and also, do you say anything? <sighs> Must be choosing, anyways, come on, Robotnik, we need to go, uh, get our spots, uh, nah. All right, we made it, and, uh, wait a minute, Robotnik, can you count? Oh, uh, yeah, sure, um, hey, wait a minute, there's only 18 here, I mean, like, now we're the 20, but, uh, Shouldn't there be, like, ten more people here? Shouldn't there be? Yeah, probably, but, I mean, like... Should he be careful? Should we care? Eh, uh, whatever. Let's just go. Eh, you know, okay. Uh, uh. Hey, everybody. Super Flesh Team here, possessing the body of Rory. And, uh, right here, you're seeing, like, a, a bunch of contestants that you're pretty sure, like, on, a Like, what? What are they doing here, and what's gonna happen? Well, basically, as you know, Season 6 will be fans versus favorites by the time Season 5 ends, and basically that. And But don't worry, Season 4 will end first before Season 5. I promise you that. Now, as you do know, is that there is about 10 newbies over there where you just saw them from. And we're gonna be choosing... 10 of of these contestants that have that were not in season four or season five or just got out and also and also if you didn't watch season five like at least the first two episodes then i'm sorry that you got spoiled but uh if you know who they are then uh just point them out but if you don't want to get spoiled then uh just um maybe maybe watch these in like canonical youtube order and don't go on playlists if you could or or do that after you know what's it's well, I think you might know what I mean, but remember, 10 of these characters that you would select are gonna be contestants in Season 6. Now, choose wisely, because only 10 of them are gonna make the cut, while the others, they're not. So, think hard, and I'll see you on the next episode, which probably won't be for like a week or so, but hey, like, what does that matter? Also, we'll, find, we'll probably do more normal videos, so uh, 